Oscar-winning director Martin Scorsese, though, a maverick behind the camera and in the way he's inspiring generations of filmmakers and movie fans alike. I had the chance to go one-on-one -on -one with him as he revealed the secrets to some of his greatest films, including his latest, Silence. It seems to me that our mission here is more urgent than ever. We must go find Father Ferreira. Martin Scorsese's new film, Silence, is the tale of two Christian missionaries searching for their lost mentor, a film the director has been trying to make for 28 years. I mean, for me, it's the struggle every day between faith and doubt. You know, and this and is based on your own. I think so, and that's experience. one of the reasons. That's one of the reasons I could not get. I couldn't figure out how to do it. I was still in the middle of it. I still am, but at least this has been expressed somehow. That struggle for director Scorsese was a personal theme. You were supposed to be a priest? I tried for a year in a uh, preparatory seminary, but I was invited to leave at the end of that year. Yes, I was very bad in my uh, studies and behavior. <laughs> Lucky for us. I realized yeah, vocation's a real vocation. You have to really know what it is before you get involved with it. It's his other career path, that of legendary, prolific filmmaker, that has made Martin Scorsese a household name. This is a shot that is, it says Phantom here. We caught up with the director in Astoria, New York, at the Museum of Moving Image, inside the new exhibit dedicated to his iconic career. I'm looking around here, 50 years oh my God. of movie making. What do you hope that the folks who get the chance to see this exhibit take away? Well, I don't know, I'm looking over there and I see these little drawings, and that's what I started doing when I was a kid. The director famously sketches many of his own storyboards, something he started doing, believe it or not, when he was 11 years old. So this movie um, is called The Eternal City? Oh yeah, it's Rome. And is there a shot that this will ever get finished? Mm, I don't know, it's pretty big. These days you can't get, well you know, since Ridley Scott made Gladiator, you never know. Of all of your films, is there a favorite? That's a hard one. I don't think I do. I mean, I guess the initial explosion, so to speak, was Mean Streets. Hey, there ain't nothing wrong with me, my friend. I'm feeling fine. Keep your mouth shut. Yeah, had great collaborators on that. Jimmy Rowe Kaito. That film that began everything is the one that I, yeah. How many more you got in you? I don't know. I don't know. I was thinking, who knows? I'd like to do one more with De Niro. We're talking about this film called The Irishman. And maybe Al Pacino for the first yeah, yeah, time? Yeah, yeah. What is it about Robert De Niro to work with? We're both adolescents together um, in the Lower East Side. He knows the world I came from. He knows the roots. He's the only one who does. There's a certain reaction to a word or a movement. Mm. And he'll know where it comes from. And he just look at each other and I know. Are you talking to me? Well, I'm the only one here. I like this shot of you and Leo mm. from The Wolf of Wall Street. Yeah. You look like you're praying. Uh, oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Yeah. Who Very are you often. praying for? Just let's get through this. <laughs> My name is Jordan Belfort. The year I turned 26, I made $49 million. At the what is it about Leonardo DiCaprio? And you? There's a 30 years difference, but he has a similar sensibility. I found it comforting to work with him. You know, um, finding someone of the new generation that I feel that comfortable with, well, explore it. And finally, let's explore his last name, the correct pronunciation, once and for all. Originally, it was Scorsese, Scotsman. Okay, Scorsese. But then they changed the name, the, the spelling in 1920. But how do you want I don't us know all? anymore. Scorsese is the way we normally I say it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank so, you. I'm like, you don't even know. This is in such a treat. A true treat and silence is in theaters now.